Effects of Virus Variants on COVID-19 Vaccine All viruses including SARS-CoV-2, the virus that causes COVID-19 evolve. When a virus replicates or makes copies of it, sometimes it changes a little bit, which is normal for a virus. These changes are called mutations. A virus with one or more new mutations is referred to as a variant of the original virus. Welcome once again to our nursing exercise channel. If this is your first time here, we have a YouTube channel that aims to enrich your knowledge about your health, fitness, medication, nutrition, diet, etc. And if it is your plan to update yourself about these important issues for all of the important tips, advice, discussion and presentation, make sure to subscribe to our channel and click on our notification bell icon. Let's start our presentation. What causes a virus to change to a new variant? When a virus is widely circulating in a population and causing many infections, the likelihood of the virus mutating increases. The more opportunities a virus has to spread, the more it replicates, and the more opportunities it has to change. Most viral mutations have little to no impact on the virus's ability to cause infections and disease. But depending on where the changes are located in the virus's genetic material, they may affect a virus's properties, such as transmission, for example. It may spread more or less easily, or severity, for example, it may cause more or less severe disease. What impact do the new variants of the COVID-19 virus have on vaccines? The COVID-19 vaccines that are currently in development or have been approved are expected to provide at least some protection against new virus variants because these vaccines elicit a broad immune response involving a range of antibodies and cells. Therefore, changes or mutations in the virus should not make vaccines completely ineffective. If any of these vaccines prove to be less effective against one or more variants, it will be possible to change the composition of the vaccines to protect against these variants. What is the World Health Organization doing to monitor and understand the impact of virus variants on the efficacy of COVID-19 vaccines? World Health Organization has been tracking mutations and variants since the start of the COVID-19 outbreak. Our global SARS-CoV-2 laboratory network includes a dedicated virus evolution working group, which aims to detect new changes quickly and assess their possible impact. Research groups have carried out genomic sequencing of the COVID-19 virus and shared these sequences on public databases, including GISAID. This global collaboration allows scientists to better track how the virus is changing. World Health Organization recommends that all countries increase the sequencing of the COVID-19 virus where possible and share data to help one another monitor and respond to the evolving pandemic. How can we prevent future new variants of the COVID-19 virus? Current measures to reduce transmission, including frequent hand washing, wearing a mask, physical distancing, good ventilation, and avoiding crowded places or closed settings, continue to work against new variants by reducing the amount of viral transmission and therefore also reducing opportunities for the virus to mutate. Scaling up vaccine manufacturing and rolling out vaccines as quickly and widely as possible will also be critical ways of protecting people before they are exposed to the virus and the risk of new variants. Priority should be given to vaccinating high-risk groups everywhere to maximize global protection against new variants and minimize the risk of transmission. Why is it important to get vaccinated even if there are new variants of the virus? 
Vaccines are a critical tool in the battle against COVID-19, and there are clear public health and life-saving benefits to using the tools we already have. We must not put off getting vaccinated because we are concerned about new variants. And we must proceed with vaccination even if the vaccines may be somewhat less effective against some of the COVID-19 virus variants. We need to use the tools we have in hand even while we continue to improve those tools. We are all safe only if everyone is safe. If you have any query, please comment in the comment box and if you enjoy watching our videos please subscribe our channel to receive notifications every time we upload a new video. Hit the bell icon twice. Thanks for watching.